welcome back to my channel. As you can see, my car is stocked full of all the Christmas goodies. My kids are so blessed to have so many grandparents and family that just spoiled them for the holidays this year. And my mom actually got us these two car seats. They were used, but they're from one of her friends and they're in amazing condition and they're for my girls. So I'm, I really wanted to get my car cleaned out before I installed these. If you know, you know, mom cars are no joke. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and unload everything and then I'm going to end up putting the car seats back in here. I hope that you find this video motivating and that it helps you in some way. And thank you so much just for being here. It means so much to me and my little channel. I cannot wait to see how it grows in 2024. unloading my car and bringing everything in and as you can see it is a total mess in here but that's okay I feel like that's just normal for after the holidays at least in this house so my kids got a little farm set and that's the first thing that they wanted open so I went ahead and agreed to open this for them that way they could play with this and it could kind of keep them occupied and I could get all of this stuff knocked out and this might have been their favorite gift that they got One of my friends got me this super cute little gift and it came in the nicest gift box and I don't know about y'all but I just cannot stand to throw them away especially when they're this nice so I wanted to repurpose this and keep all these little tiny pieces in there and that's a goal that I have for this year is just to keep my kids play sets more organized and that way they can learn when they play too. And I feel like this box is going to be helpful. I just hope that we can keep the toys more organized because I feel like over time they just get all mixed together. Like this stuff will get mixed with the kitchen stuff and you know how it is. But hopefully I can stay a little more organized and just toy rotate a little bit better this year. If you are a mama who currently toy rotates with your kids, Please let me know any tips that you have, especially if you have a smaller space. My girls share a room and we don't have like a playroom or anything, so it gets a little tricky, especially with the amount of toys that they have. So I think I will be going through their toys and trying to donate what they don't play with anymore. But yeah, if you have any tips, please let me know. Friends. Do it again, do 
Okay, 20 years later, I'm finally done unpackaging that toy and talking about packaging. You'll see here in just a second all the boxes and little bags. I'm also going to save these for next year. I just feel bad throwing them away. There's literally nothing wrong with them. I'm going to get these coats hung up and all of these groceries actually came from my mom's house. She is the sweetest. She always just sends me home with the most random little things and it just makes me feel so loved as a daughter and as a mom and just the way that she's here for me. So I always appreciate the little things like this. I tell her all the time, mom, we just went grocery shopping, like we don't need it. And she just loves to send me on my way with a bunch of little goodies. This bag you see here, it's filled with a bunch of random stuff, but most of it is clothes for the girls. They got a lot of clothes this Christmas, and I'm so thankful. I love all the cute little outfits. Being a boy mom is so fun, and I also love being a girl mom too, because I just love dressing them up in all the cute girly little outfits and matching them. It's so fun to me. to me.
almost done unboxing all of the presents. There's one bag that just has like baby wipes in it. And then this bag, I'm not even sure what this has in it. So I'm going to go ahead and undo those bags and then I'm going to get dinner started. I'm just throwing a ham into the oven because we have it and it sounds good. So hopefully everyone will like that. So yeah, let's, let's get to it. your mom does that too um I know some of my friends like her mom does the same thing um and it's honestly the sweetest thing ever I cannot wait well I can't wait I don't want my kids to grow up faster than they already are but I just know one day like I will definitely be the same way but she gave me since it's New Year's today she gave me black eyed peas and diced tomatoes let me know if y'all eat this on the new year I know it's like a good luck thing so, I'm going to try this. Hopefully, it will bring some good luck. I'm just going to go ahead and cut the tags off of the girls' clothes and open a few more of my son's toys so we can get those put away in his room. And just watching this footage back, I am so thankful for everything that my kids got this year. They are so incredibly blessed and as a family, we are blessed to have them and raise them and it just makes me so emotional watching this and I really want to give back and go through, I'm saying and so much, um, <laughs> I really want to go through all of their toys and just declutter and their clothes that are in good condition and find a place that I can donate that it would actually go to a really good cause. I feel like 
Goodwill sometimes they just really upsell on their prices and I know that there's so many mothers in our community that need resources and I'm in a few mom groups and I see it all the time so I just need to get some stuff together and then make a post and just try to help someone in need because times are really tough everything is so expensive and if there's any way that I can give back to the community I 100% want to do so especially if it's an area that we have more than what we need like clothes that they've outgrown or toys that are in good condition so I definitely encourage you to do the same because motherhood can be so isolating sometimes and so hard in general so if we can help each other out with things like clothes and toys I just feel like it could be such a blessing in somebody else's life these mugs are so adorable. I got these from my mother-in-law and father-in-law. And I think they go perfect with my decor. I'm not going to take them down um, after Christmas, which like I said, this video is after Christmas. But I think they go really well with my winter decor also. You talk about faith it's time to prep dinner like I said we are making ham and black-eyed peas since it's good luck so I'm gonna go ahead and get that ready and then pick up all the clothes that I took the tags off of and again I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for taking the time and hanging out with me today I do put out weekly motivational motherhood content so if that's something that interests you Please hit that subscribe button and I can't wait to see y'all on the next one. Bye.